I'm here to see Eleanor Reese. I'm her lawyer. I want you to know you're dealing with a very explosive patient. How long have you you've been a lawyer? Two years. Are you kind of old to be a lawyer only two years? I mean, what are you, slow? She's not a danger to herself or others. This is my lawyer. She knows exactly what her medication's doing to her, and she's furious about it. This is where I write down what it does to me. Nobody knows more about what that medicine does to me than I do. Yeah, tell me I'm not right. If we win, you would be representing 150,000 people. Now listen to me. This case, this could take years. I just want you to know what you're up against. Excuse me. James Adams, counsel for St. Mary's. I believe you already know Dr. Booker. Have you seen the care package that the hospital sent over? Trying to bury us in paperwork. Honey, you can't keep pushing yourself like this. If I don't do it, it won't get done. Yes, they can sometimes have side effects, but these medications are the only effective treatment. It was over before we started. I'm afraid I got bad news. The hospital asked the Supreme Court to review the case. It's Christmas. Merry Christmas. We, you can't let this ruin Christmas. You gotta have faith, Colette. What good does that do? If you win my case, you make other people's lives better. But you don't live your own life. What do you think? It's fine. It's not fine. It looks like a balloon. <laughs> Why do you want to help me? Because I'm here as your friend. They were forcing medications on her. This is about the right to refuse. Five stops. You're a brave woman, Eleanor. Yeah, she's a nice person. And she's a good lawyer. Yeah, even if she did lose today. That was a joke, Colette.